they round the far turn. Trinneberg is second. Hansen is third. I'll have another. Creative cause moves up on the far outside. But it's Bodie Meister at the top of the stretch. And Bodie Meister's got a five length lead. I'll have another on the outside. Now is moved into second. And then down toward the outside. Creative cause. Bodie Meister holding on to the lead. I'll And Normandy Invasion is storming home, and they're into the stretch, and Normandy Invasion has taken the lead on the outside. Orb is coming with giant strides in the center of the track, and here comes Orb on the outside now to take the lead as they come down to the 16th pole. It is Orb in front from Normandy Invasion, my loot, and Golden Soul between horses down to the wire. Orb has won the Kentucky Derby for Chuck McGee. It was Golden Soul. Revolutionary came late on the inside and then it was Normandy Invasion and it was Orb today in the Derby. Now they make their way into the far turn and it is Uncle Cy the leader. Cheat 2 is alongside and California Chrome is third just outside the leaders. Samrod is right next to him. The four of them are together then intense holiday. Tapacher Metal count. Dance is right there in contention. Dance with fate is next, and they're coming to the top of the stretch. And California Chrome makes his move for the lead. It is California Chrome on the outside. Samrat runs at him with the eight pole. California Chrome is pulling away. California Chrome into the final furlong. He's got a five length lead on his competition. It is California Chrome in front. And from the back of the pack on the outside, commanding curve is taken second. But California Chrome shines bright in the Kentucky Derby. Commanding curve was second. And then came Danza in third. The final time, two minutes, 3.66 seconds. It's American Farrow who has taken the lead on the outside. In between horses, it's firing line. Dortmund is down at the rail as they come into the final furlong. American Pharaoh firing line not done yet. And these two come into the final 16th. It's American Pharaoh in front. Firing line. Dortmund is third. Frosted is fourth. Coming to the finish. American Pharaoh and Victor Espinosa have won the Kentucky Derby. Firing line was second. Dortmund was third. Frosted finished fourth in a final time of two minutes three. Stretch. And it's Nyquist. Nyquist has taken the lead on the outside. Gunrunner, second at the rail. Five lengths back to Destin in third. And they come to the final. Furlong Exaggerator is closing in. Nyquist to catch with a 16th to go. Gunrunner, Exaggerator on the outside. Nyquist and Exaggerator. They're coming to the line together. And Nyquist is still unbeaten. He has won the Kentucky Derby. Exaggerator was second and then a photo for third of us. Two runners and then it's a three length gap back to Gormley. McCracken has been unleashed on the far outside and Classic Empire is beginning his charge and he's coming wide as they turn for home and it is always dreaming in front. Always dreaming with Battle of Midway a length and a half behind as they come into the final furlong. Looking at Lee is making a bid now through on the inside up into second. Always dreaming with a two and a half length lead at 16th to go. Looking at Lee is second. Then comes Battle of Midway, Classic Empire. They're coming to the line and the dream comes true. Always dreaming has won the Kentucky Derby. And it was looking at Lee second, followed by Battle of Midway and Classic Empire. The final time was two minutes, 3.59. Magic start to pull away from the others, and they're into the stretch. And it's Justify and Mike Smith turning for home in front. Good Magic and Jose Ortiz a link behind as they come into the final furlong. Bravazos down the center of the track, and then Audible on the inside, who's now up in a third. Justify a two length lead as they come to the final 16th. Good Magic on the outside is second. Audible third toward the inside, then it's still regard. They're coming to the wire. He's just awesome. Justify has won the Kentucky Derby. It was very close for a second. Audible may have got there inside of Good Magic, then it's still regard in a final time of 
two minutes, 4.20 seconds. He's long range, Tutty, third and four wide and moving up is Country House's Booty Express plummets through the field. And here comes Code of Honor. And he bursts through an opening on the inside of maximum security. And they're into the stretch. Country House on the outside. Code of Honor down through the rail. Maximum security keeps on fighting. War of Will is there too as they come to the final furlong. It is Country House on the outside. Maximum security so dead game. He keeps battling on. Maximum security. Country House went two down to the line. Oh my goodness, the longest shot! 